Hey y'all, I'm back for another Holiday Murder Minute. Well, if you've been listening along the way, you know that I've been sharing stories of murders that took place over the holidays. And the one I'm going to talk about today took place back in 2014 in Pennsylvania. A man named Dustin Clock killed his wife, Stephanie Kill Huffman, during an argument on Christmas Eve around 10 p.m. Klopp tried to clean up the flood and then moved her body to a shed on their property. So the next day rolls around, which is Christmas Day, and he packs up the couple's two kids, takes them to his parents' home for a Christmas celebration like nothing had even happened. When Klopp returned home, he called the state police and said that he wanted to turn himself in for murdering his wife. He arrived at the police barracks around 6.30 that evening. Now, at the scene, police found Stephanie's body in a car carrier bag in the shed, and she had been punched in the face, had her throat slashed, and her head had been bashed in with an axe. Now, he had also sexually assaulted her, but it's unclear whether that had happened before or after the murder. The next morning, Plop was arraigned on charges of homicide, abuse of a corpse, and tampering with or fabricating evidence, and he was denied bond. But y'all, this case would never go to trial. Plop hanged himself in his jail cell about two months after he killed Stephanie, and he died two, day, two days later. So now there's two kids without a mom or dad. Well, that's been another holiday murder moment on Murder Minute. Y'all have a great day.